So one of the most common questions I always have with uh, series finales, uh, or even season finales, uh, when it comes to reacting to shows on this channel is, I always ask, am I ready for this? Because <laughs> you never truly are, I feel like. Uh, very, very much like with Gravity Falls, Amphibia, now with, you know, the series finale of The Owl House, you know, season three, episode three, watching and dreaming. Am I ready for this? Because they have a lot to cover in this episode based off what happened in the previous two. A lot of lingering questions still hanging up in the air. Some th some stuff that I think we have a good idea where we know it's going, but it will be nice to actually see it occur, you know? And And like I said, am I truly ready for this? I don't know. I'm expecting something incredibly emotional. Potentially heartbreaking, bittersweet, uh, very funny. Uh, Our house is very much known for its humor. And I think we're going to get all of that in this one. And it's going to, again, like the others, it's very much going to be, it's going to be very difficult to say goodbye to this show. It is, it is very good. I have enjoyed my time here with it. I've enjoyed sharing my experience with all of you, interacting with the fandom and with the community and the, my premieres and the live chats. And in, obviously in the comments of the videos, and I hope you all have been enjoying my experience as well, watching you, know, you witnessing my experience. So, uh, very excited, very bittersweet, very nervous, very anxious for this one. Um, I mean, I, I, I'm just like, uh, I've, I have a bad feeling that there's going to be some heartache in this one. I really do. I don't know why. I just have a bad feeling that something is bad's going to happen to someone on this show for, for some reason. I hate having that feeling. And of course, I expect uh, Hootie. I expect all the Hootie in this episode. I expect to see the Owl House himself be featured no less than 40 minutes. I expect 40 minutes of screen time. Anything less, this episode can go no higher than a 10 out of 10. So let's watch the series finale of The Owl House. Bruce, you human, human. You have to wake up. What? Who the hell was that? Where's this the is this uh the collector doing this? How did I get here? <gasps> string bean, it's you. Aw, little string bean. I'm so happy to see you. So is cute. Okay? I wonder if this is uh something the collector has created. It's like Battle World in Marvel Comics. Very eerie. I like it. I like the atmosphere. Oh, they're all petrified. No, no, no. It's all you're doing. You helped Bellos meet the collector. Oh Your shit. Your actions led to this. You've been the real villain this whole time. Oh no. That's not Amity. I don't know what That's I not really her. I never do this. Oh my god, could you imagine if that was actually real? And Amity really went after her? I mean, obviously this isn't... This isn't legit. It can't be. <laughs> yes, it is. Think you can keep me from my family. You got another thing coming. Don't worry. Mama Bear's upset. We're all present and accounted for. You'll be staying right there. Ooh. Huh? They're all like... They're kind of living... Through their worst fears right here. Cages, after all. What are you talking about? I eat. Oh no. Oh yeah, totally going through their worst fears here. Nice, right? Ah, Bill! Bill! You crazy jerk. How'd I get here? You crazy jerk. What's wrong? Don't you recognize your siblings? Don't worry. We saved the best spot for you. Yo, this opening is something. I'm down with it. You know, Luz going through the fear of everyone being angry at her and leaving her and being alone you know for helping Bellos. And... You know, Luz, finally believed that there was this big, bright future ahead of myself. You destroyed my home and any chance I had. Oh, that imagery. I have no future now. Oh. Dude, Willow angry? That hits different. Dude, the collector is fucking with them so bad. This is some evil shit right here. 
everyone helped you get back to your mom. I'll never see my dad again. Oh, look at the tears in Gus's eyes. I, I swear, we'll get him back. Tell that to him. Oh my god. Oh no, Hunter. It's just followed orders. Did you I see the Flapjack statue? School. Then I met Flapjack. He was more than a talisman. All right, my best friend. And then I lost him helping you. But you still get to have your own talisman. You oh, the voice him. acting. He's killing it. I challenge you to a witch's battle. No, come on, Luz. Don't don't fall for this. Wait, say that again? That's not right. It's not witch's battle. A witch's battle? Yeah, that's the collector's ignorance there. But you're not Amity, are you? This really shows you how powerful the collector really is, though. It's very, it's very, it's frightening. Of course we're How dare you? I challenge you to a witch's duel. Yeah. And the Amity I know would never misquote the good witch's aura. Luce knows her so well. Oh. Luce? Amity, is that you? Is it really you? Yes. Yo. Playing games with you, oh, so that was actually you them. That's wild. You want to save anyone, you have to wake up. He had them on puppet strings. Think about it. You turn on the light. Aw. Aw. Do it. Wow. Ooh, the collector's... Collector, the collector has gone full unhinged. Mean it. Oh, there you go. Show them the light, dude. That's dark. <laughs> oh, King, buddy. Huh? See, it's okay. Wow, the collector's just using everyone as just as like a toy. That's how he's treating every everybody. Is this real? Is that loose? Reunion. Reunion. Yes! Bitch. Hug! Oh, I love it. Oh, all the kisses. Oh, Luce. She said, get over here, you witch. <laughs> How dare Bellows use rain like this? Wipe them out. I want to be your friends. And besides, my powers don't work on King. Hmm. Dog? Yeah! Because he's a titan! <laughs> you worked in the castle. Bellos did right? not know this. The big old heart still beaten too. Full grown. They're more powerful than anyone. Oh no. You know, I just had an interesting idea. Show them just how much fun your games are. Oh no. In person. Then they'll all want to be your friend. You think? Aw. Mm -hmm. You gotta really oh, feel yeah. bad for the collector though. He just wants. He just wants friends and companionship, doesn't want to be alone anymore, but he's being so easily manipulated. Such a shame. How did you get back to the demon realm? That reunion was everything. Very long story. Bellos, in the human realm. There was what? <laughs> when? We saw Kikimura. She had... was a lot to deal with. Yeah. I can imagine. <laughs> and then my mom decided to... Whoa! How did that happen? Uh... That's a shorter story. Oh, is that your palace, man? Oh my god, they're all, all just catching up. Huh? Dude, this episode's trippy. Oh, hello. I don't get it, King. Though you love I love the collector's theme. You choose these itty bitty spiders over me. Wow. Stinks, no, 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 no. Are awesome. Yeah, especially the itty I disagree ones. about the spiders being like awesome, Luz. Disagree. It's not fun for everyone else. From the draining spell. So? Toys break all the time. You just fix them. No, buddy. Oh boy. Doesn't work like that. Do you not understand what death Yeah. Ooh, that's is... Well, don't worry. Let me show you some of my favorite games. Oh, no. Yeah, this child does not even understand how death works. That is terrible. Let me go. Fight it. Fight it, Rain. I swear nothing better happened to Rain. No, I think I'll keep you around a little longer. Oh my god, Bellos, I hate you. <laughs> Bellos is definitely up there. Maybe is the the cream of the crop as the most terrible villain. 
Oh, Pac-Man! <laughs> Got stug. Good string bead. Play some marbles, okay. Dude, this is a bop. Oh, this is good though. <laughs> I really didn't know where they were gonna go with this finale. And right, at least so far, I like that they kind of scaled it down a bit and really focusing on our main three here. Also, Jenga is so much fun. Maybe not his version of, get, of Jenga, but he's not having a fun time. I think they need to... I think I barfed like 12 times. <laughs> Wanna make it a lucky number 13? Luce noticed something there. I think, I think you need to kind of... Don't reject him necessarily, you know? If anyone can talk some sense into them, it's Luce. Yeah. A little empathy here. You know, a little sympathy for his situation, maybe. King lied. Bellows lied. Even they lied. Oh, okay. Who's they? Poor kid. The archivist, my siblings. Oh, let's play a game, they said. Let's play hide and seek. Ooh, lore? And see if the Titans want to play. Oh, did they set him up? Baby Titans were the cutest, just like King. Aww. And they were all so welcoming. They were scared of their power. So one by one, they disappeared. Wow, Until yeah. there was one Titan left. We read that in the book. I was the bad guy. Oh, <sighs> wow. So you got all the blame for what happened. So all of them. I found the last Titan, and he's my friend now. Oh, this oh, poor kid. I know it's just pretend. I'll pretend as long as I want. Wow. But that's not what you want. I appreciate all the layers they we know what it's put on this character. And abandoned. Hmm. And misunderstood. You're with a group that can relate. What if we showed you how we became friends? <gasps> See, this is what I was talking about. What do you think? Can we tell you our stories? Come on, buddy. Say yes. Oh my god, I love that Rain is fighting so hard. Please don't let something happen to Rain. Yeah, piss off. Is big enough to do what I need. No. Ugh. Oh my god. Rain's the only one right now who knows. But it still beats. Oh uh, no. Oh uh, no. Oh. I can't believe Bellus is doing this. We've been seeing that heart for so long. I've always been wondering if it's ever going to play a huge part in the story. Shit. Oh my god, worst this is this is absolute worst case scenario. Oh, look at that animation. No, Bellus is the boiling isles now. <laughs> yeah. There you go. It worked. Wow, look at all of them. Steve! <laughs> Where the heck are we? Oh, Camila. Help me get her down. Please, please free Camila. Guys. Where's Luce? Oh boy. We need Hootie. Also, Hootie has not been in the episode for 40 minutes. I found my way here and I met Owlbert, Hootie, and Ida the Owl Lady. Wow, that seems so long ago. None of us felt like we fit in, so we decided to not fit in together. All right, this is good. This is, this is good. Game called Grudge Beat. Bulk bites you, and the rules are nonsense. Remember how I kept forgetting nonsense. that it was called Grudge Beat, and I kept calling it Grugby? These days. We made the best of it. And you were the star player. <laughs> Look at Ida's face. Was her captain? Hi, I'm Bartholomew. Want to be my Grudge Beat buddies? It's him! Run! Aww. <laughs> oh, very nice. This was a good episode. It's where Ida helped me make a connection with the Yeah. Eyes. Some wild magic. Everyone can recognize Titan magic. He must really like you if he's shown you this much. What? He never told me about it, though. Did he say that was Titan magic? They just need a little kindness and forgiveness. Kindness and forgiveness, huh? hear that oh boy hear what this is probably the most 
Anyone has like actually like cared about this kid ever. Breathing. Emperor freaking Bellos does Don't tell me it's Bellos just brought life to the freaking island. I'm going to be honest with you. I did not expect that. I wasn't thinking that. Oh my god. He just went all kaiju. It's amazing how he is still in that. He's still very much a witch hunter. He and he still is trying to accomplish his goal here. It's 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 amazing. Ooh. No. What is he doing? You just need kindness. No. He doesn't. No. He's freaking evil. <laughs> Lose his face. This isn't gonna work on him. Look, we can all be buddies now. No. That's Bellos. Oh huh? damn. But I thought it was doing the right thing. Oh, buddy, your heart was in the right no, place. No, you did good. You did awesome, yeah. But this is a little more complicated. No! Oh! <gasps> Whoa, 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 what does that mean? No. Loose? No. What's happening? Ida, King. Looks like we're gonna be split up again. No! I feel like I should be used to this feeling by now, but I still don't know what to say. Oh! I hated that! Oh my god, the the line delivery was incredible incredible acting i don't know exactly what happens when that happens she's not dead is she? she go no luce just sacrificed herself for the collector that tells you everything about her that just tells you who she is what is this oh no Oh no, Camila! Oh, that is so freaking sad. Yoo-hoo! You can come out now. Oh, their oh, their faces. Well, it's okay. I'll fix her. No, you 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 you've never seen death. I miss her here. They could have taken her. I freaking hate. Oh, oh shit! Oh my God, Bellis is. The worst freaking villain I've seen in a long time. That is... What a... Despicable... Freaking man. Oh my god. Like, I, I'm not... I mean, I'm not saying she's dead dead. I really don't think they're gonna kill Luce. Legit. I know what I should have said. I should have thanked them. Oh. And just... Being absolute hero. Is that King's father? Hootie? What? But he does get his good looks from me. Bad girl! <laughs> oh, <laughs> the shirt! You can't actually be the Titan Titan. Is that the Titan? Is that. You're the Boiling Isles. No way. The Titan is all. Dead looking. Yeah. Does that mean I'm. Oh so, boy. Uh, no, 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 don't want to do that. Do without a portal. You really will be dead. Oh, so we're not there yet. Leave this. You're King's dad. I am both king and queen. Best of both things. He's got a dad bod. I love it. Dad works fine. The robe. <laughs> it's so good. This is the space in between. Mm. Well, in, in between a lot of places. And I've been stuck here for quite some so time. So some sort of like but not exactly purgatory, but eye on my child. Aww. And those who have been kind to him. Ah, all the memories. I was willing to do anything to keep my kids safe. Yeah. But I attacked the wrong person. Mm. Dragged the collector down here for nothing. Does that make sense? Wow, he acknowledges. Bellows? What? No. Been drinking what? Eat his homemade apple <laughs> Bella says he's trying to save humanity. No. Bellows fully knows what he is doing. So and he knows. Don't, don't these feelings come from the same place? 
You assume Bella he knows genocide isn't right. Place, but that man doesn't care about anything but his need to be the hero in his own doom. Yeah, exactly. And because of that, he fears what he can't. That's control. a classic villain trope. That fear is going to win. And those are like the worst kind of villains when they think what they're doing is right, and they see themselves as the hero. You ready to stop him? Yes. What? Yes. What can I Come do? on, loose. You've already helped King so much. Let's go. Are you sure you want to give this power to me? Hell yeah. The question is. Everything has led to this. You choose yourself. This is your destiny. Let's go. Oh, come on. Go kick his ass. So you have to defeat him fast. Ooh, what? listen to that My power music. Won't last forever, so use your time wisely. Key to the owl lady. Send her my regards. <laughs> Big fan. Big fan. <laughs> I love you, son. Oh. Oh. Love that. oh God, I want to hear what he's. I want to hear what it is. Wow. Dude, those tears she had. Oh. She just like had a feeling. I, I I feel like right. She sensed it. And what about Luz? This is too much Luz for kids. Yeah. It means she's way too stubborn to let any of this get her down. I think I know how we can... I mean, Camila is probably absolutely freaking terrified right now, but I love that she said that, though. Dude, seeing King go freaking power up like that was badass. Why is it anything working? Oh? Oh, no! I'm sorry for everything! Oh, buddy. They're doing such. Oh my god. You feel so so much sympathy for him. Freaking Bellos, man. Ooh. Loose? Let's go! Dude, the, the music's absolutely slaying it right now. Killing it. Hell yeah! Oh, holy shit! Oh my god, she looks amazing! I still can't think of anything to say! <laughs> she doesn't have a line. It's loose, alright. <laughs> oh my god, she looks so freaking badass. Are you kidding me right now? I have not wanted a villain to be disposed of so much in so long. I honestly can't find any likable thing about Bellos whatsoever. Incredible villain. If we're talking about a villain, incredible. I know. Everyone's still in the archives. Because you absolutely just hate him. And that that is the sign of a good villain. Not one positive thing I could say about Bellos. Come on, Luz. There you go. Mama Ida. Dude, Luz is getting to be like a like a witch. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my god, I love this little family. <laughs> oh, look at look at the colors there. Look at look at those effects. I just love these little little moments where they just like they're like having fun doing this too, which is incredible. We gotta give the music a huge round of applause. Oh, it's so great. Oh my god, I love that Camila. So I like she's chipping in here. You're doing it, buddy! He's helping! You're doing it! Oh, look at how that's drawn! Oh, that's so absolutely disgusting and it's amazing. Wow, what a shot! Oh, that's epic! Oh, she's running out of time. Come on, Ida. You know where magic comes from. <laughs> the tooth! <laughs> Let's go, folks! Here comes the theme. Nice! That whistling, though. 
Oh, Rain. Can we save Rain? Please tell me we're gonna save Rain. Oh, reunion! It's okay, Rain. Oh. I gotcha. Still not used to this new look. But it doesn't matter. I'm just happy you're here. Oh. Look. Fluffier? Fluffier. How long was I out for? <laughs> this freaking monster. Oh, what a shot. Oh. When they go, like, full display of witch's powers, it's incredible. Love it so much. There you go, Keg. Mm. Yes. 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 The good witch loose. I love how it all just came down to loose, right? How great is that? Wow. Like, think about it. It came down to two humans. In this world. In this fight. That's, that's, that's cool. That's really cool. What an action-packed finale. I didn't know what direction they were going to go in. I mean, I think it's a missed opportunity to have Hootie eat Bellows, but it, you know, that's okay. No, nope. beggars can't be choosers sometimes. Dude, you did it, buddy. No, no, no. It's fine. Yes. <gasps> yes. I love that for him. Oh, beautiful. Ah, oh, beautiful music. Beautiful. What a moment this is. Oh, I wonder if they're going to do, like, a time jump. You did it, Luce. Oh, wait. He's still... Are you, how are you still here? Thank goodness you saved me from... Can't trust him. Are you kidding? Curse. Did you see that sword? <laughs> She's... Yes, I, I, was, I was cursed with a terrible... <laughs> She's terrible like, you see that face? Dark magic, just like your Holy shit. To do all those horrible She's not things. falling for it. But now I'm free. Oh, here comes the... The boiling grain. Don't you want to make peace? Ooh, that's cool. That's a nice touch. Just as bad. Just as conniving. Just as evil. Oh, shut up. Just as unforgivable as those witches. Dude, you are terrible. We're better than this. There's not one redeeming thing about him. Well, we ain't. Yes! Was extremely satisfying. <laughs> oh my god! My claws. <laughs> they just stomped on him! <laughs> it's so violent! Wow. You do have tall jeans. <laughs> That's Papa. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Your dad had a message for you. Yes! No! I loaf you? I loaf you. <laughs> Bread pun! <laughs> Isn't it amazing? We did a bread it. pun! Everything after oh, that's great. We stuck together. I just... Okay, so I just got this horrible sinking feeling. Because I'm like, this is almost over. What a fantastic series. It's a shame we were robbed of a third oh. season. But I'm glad this exists, because they could easily have just cancelled so it. To see everyone safely released from the archives. I mean, I'm happy we at least got this. Steve! Precious Steve! Oh! <laughs> of that, Where's Hootie? Got to reunite with their families and loved ones. <laughs> oh, you stay where you are, Delia, alright? Piss off. <laughs> Do not like her. Nice. <laughs> Which one? Oh, that's beautiful. Oh my god, I love it. Well, they were in for a nice surprise. Oh, they showed him the, sh <laughs> the wolf shirt. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Okay, I'm I'm digging this. Oh, the hair. <laughs> a bump. Oh. 
Come on. And not everyone Freaking. is keen to change things. Ew. Go. Get out of here. Leave. Yeah. Piss off, Tara. <laughs> I love this. Oh! Oh! Faces! No more guard. Yeah, there we go. Aw. Hey, buddy! Welcome back. Lilith! Where's Hootie? Aw. <laughs> Sweet. The little hug lift. Aw, the... Mama and daughter. Ah, they meet! They finally met! Ah! Yes? Yes? Hootie? Hoot! Ah! Look at him! This is a beautiful face! Ah! My Hootie! No, <laughs> you see Amity's face? Francois. Oh, I love how, a lot of growing up to do. I love how much so Kegel loves Francois. To return to the stars. Really? No one argued. Oh! I think I heard King. Oh! I hope I see you again. Oh! We got our happy ending, but I realized something in that moment when the Titan had finally passed on. Oh! The powers of the glyphs. I had learned the Titan's language, but now I had no one to yeah. speak it to. Yeah. Because they say it's Titan magic. Please. I, I may have known that, and I just forgot. Heart, I'll never forget it. <laughs> new chapter begins. But a new one was just beginning. Oh, what an epic shot. Wow. <gasps> oh my god, that picture of Hootie! <laughs> Look at her! I can't believe you're already leaving for college. Time jump. Remind me, what major did you pick again? Come on, Mama. You know me. I picked all of them. <laughs> all of them. How is that even possible? Oh, I love her outfit. It's been tough, but me and String Bean figured out a way of doing things. It'll be nice to finally see everyone again after all this time. Wow. You saw them last week. <laughs> me. It's it's the piercings. The others. Oh my god, you see that picture of String Bean with the apple? Oh, that's so cool. It's so cool. They're able to still travel in between. <laughs> wow. I like how they're doing this ending. <gasps> He's grown up! Father! <laughs> oh, he's got a... <laughs> oh, he's so sweet. Are they together? Yes? No? Oh my god, Willow looks awesome. Oh! Thank you for finding me! I love this music, though. This is really cool again to see everything so many years later. Oh my god, look at her! Wish there was more Hootie, though. It's alright, I'll forgive it. Because this was really good ending. Oh my god! Dude, I love all their... <laughs> I love how they all look. I love their... Their older design. Like, their designs over their older selves. They all look good. Oh, look at Bob! <laughs> I just love these little redesigns. Oh, that is so great. Removing those. Those are the old ways. Oh, I love... Again, I'm loving these all these little redesigns. Hell yeah, it's gone! They did it! <laughs> I like how we're all gathering the whole crew together. <laughs> like, I'm happy that this is all happening. Like, like TJ Hill freaking killing with this music right now. I, I'm like, I'm so happy seeing this. I like to see the story kind of like continue past the main story just to kind of get a glimpse into the lives of our characters post story but this is so sad because this is it this is we're, we're ending here university of wild magic i love it the way it should be mind you 
<gasps> Look at Gus! Headmaster Ida? Are you kidding? Who would have ever thought, right? King! Oh my god! He's a bit of a bigger boy! I love that they didn't get closed off. King Sinera, I love that. Aww. Hmm. The hook. Birthday, helping us rebuild the aisles. And sixteenth, and seventeenth. We wanted to make it up to you. All about your King Sinaras from the human realm. Those tattoos. They sounded a lot less haunted than our birthdays. <laughs> Nevertheless, I made sure we followed Camila's instructions perfectly. <laughs> Did you? Oh no! He's still being used. <laughs> Is it? Oh, look at that dress. At least he wasn't a disco ball this time, <laughs> Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Muy bueno. What? No way! King is bringing the magic back. Yes. Yeah, whole new glyph language to try out. Guys. Hell yeah! Another surprise. Another surprise? Beautiful colors. This is all too much. This is so mo like I'm so. Oh. This is so much. I love that this is a full-on happy ending. Ida, King, thank you for everything. Aw. Right back at you, kiddo. Weirdos? Weirdos. <laughs> Just remember how this show started. One, two, three! Bye! Bye! How many times do we ever hear that <laughs> whenever we hear bye? <laughs> we all just probably all everybody just repeats it. That that was I really enjoyed that. I thought that was a very fitting ending. I feel very glad that we got a happy ending there. Um you know, this show, of all the shows I've watched, I feel like this show has meant more to, to more to people than any other one that I, I have watched on YouTube. Like, in, just in terms of interacting with the community for, for this show, the comments or whatever, just hearing what it means, just reading what it means to people, hearing other reactors talk about it. Um... You know, this show definitely so many people can relate to so many things that goes on in this show. And, you know, and also for, for a show to have all the representation that it that it has. Right. It, it's definitely a, a, a show where people can look to and turn to and feel welcomed and relate. And. You know, it can say like, you know, this is for me, you know, and and that that's an amazing thing. I the fact that when I decided to turn my YouTube channel into a reaction channel and decided to go eventually focus on animated shows, I did not anticipate watching shows like Gravity Falls, Owl House, Amphibia. I didn't anticipate that. I had no plans for that. And it just happened. And I forgot how much I enjoy shows like this. And I'll give it to the Owl House. The Owl House put me through the ringer of every emotion I, I could go through. To give us a villain that was, honestly, as horrible as he is, Bellos as terrible and reprehensible and just absolutely evil he can be. What an incredible villain for this show. To go the, for them to take things in a direction like they did, you know, in having a villain trying, you know, working and manipulating behind the scenes on eventually 
eliminating an entire race. Obviously, we can we can look into our own world history for things like that. Obviously, we know with you know World War II, you know, with Nazi Germany and all that, for example. And the fact that they did that in this show, essentially, like that's powerful. That that is that is incredibly powerful stuff. Uh, I'm all over the place right now. That was a lot. That episode. Like I said, it's a shame we didn't get a full season to kind of close this series out to really allow a lot of breathing room and let this arc really play out. But for what they had to work with and for them to do what they did in these three specials could not have been easy. I can't imagine the challenge it was to write an entire conclusion and season's worth of material and jam pack it into... 45 plus minute episodes that that isn't challenging that is incredibly challenging and i feel they they pulled it off i felt these episodes were paced very well i like i like how they used credit sequences to kind of tell a lot of the story i thought that was really good like make these little mini music videos super smart super effective And, you know, I will always say this and i said this before i said this with amphibia i said this with gravity falls as much as those shows, and this show too, as much as these shows have been criticized by many, not everybody, but a lot of people saying they start off too slow, it takes a lot to get into, it takes a while for it to get moving, I don't agree with that. I think everything that happens in those early episodes for all three of these shows are so incredibly important, and I get, I've said this with the previous other two shows, the um, the feelings... And the emotions you have in the in these final episodes and those final minutes, you would have not have felt that if you didn't get those moments early in the early going in those episodes where people like to deem as filler. They're not filler. There's no such thing as filler episodes. When it comes to these shows, definitely. I mean, there are there are shows that generally are filler that. Don't progress. Don't develop any character relationships. Don't develop any characters. Uh, don't move the story forward. You don't have to move the Stuart story forward to gain something. And Al House did that so well, giving us those moments with King Ida and Luce. All those little adventures where you think are just kind of meaningless when they really aren't. Because then you get a moment like that at the end when all three of them are fighting Bellos. That sense of, you know, that sense of just family and togetherness and teamwork. They're so in sync. You've truly felt something there. And then I, I, I got to give them credit for letting that stuff happen. Letting things breathe, take their time. And it works out and it pays off. It pays off so fucking well just bravo and i think what i loved most about this uh this finale and again i apologize i'm all over the place i'm all over the place uh but whatever i don't care deal with it what i really enjoyed about this finale most was it all came down to our main three as much as i love you know gus amity willow hunter When it all comes down to it, it's about Luce, Eden, King. And for the fate of the Boiling Isles to come down to someone who is a human who is not from there and to save a place that took her in when nothing else would, besides Camila, obviously, besides besides her own mother, but everything else around her, no one embraced her who she was and they embraced her. You know, weirdos, right? And this place embraced her. And and the fact that she wanted to save it and was willing to die for it says everything about Luz. She actually pretty much technically almost died. She died almost. She was in the, the, the little between plane, right? And hanging out with King's king's dad which was a great moment i love how king's dad just had a full-on dad bod he got the 
the <laughs> the the bad curl the bad girl's uh coven shirt he's got the pajama pants the robe oh full on he's just a full on dad and that little <laughs> that little line for king i love you was brilliant that was beautiful as much as i sometimes hate puns that was just too cute because it was so king king you i just love how you knew king would love it but yeah, for Luz to just even sacrifice her life for the Collector, for someone who at first they thought was such a bad person, when all he just wanted was some friends. And he just had no understanding of anything, how anything worked. He didn't even know what happens to mortals. He thinks you could just fix death when you can't. That's so sad. And Luce being Luce, and like King said, you know, if there's anyone who could talk to him, it's Luce. But, you know, Luce being Luce tried to get through to him, tried to bring him in like how she was feeling like an outsider. And how Eda and King embraced her. She embraced the collector. And for her to try to for her to sacrifice herself for him was brilliant was just incredible. And it's just such a full, just character defining moment. And then for her to get those powers and become the good witch loose. She looks so awesome. Didn't she? She looked amazing. Uh, uh, she, that whole sequence of fighting Bellos was just getting, see, getting to see loose. Let's go full, witch was incredible. And that moment at the end with Bellos trying to plead with her, her, her face she was not having it she didn't wasn't buying it for a second i I, oh my god that was stone cold and for them to just start stomping on bellows (laughs) that's too fucking good oh screw him right what a bastard uh and i was hoping they were going to do a time skip and i loved how they did the time skip i loved how they integrated the credits into it and just have them all meet up one by one. Gather. We're getting to see the whole, this whole, the bowling alley is rebuilt in a new way, obviously. Uh, they're getting rid of the sigils, right? I think they're called the sigils, if I can remember correctly. I think I called Luce's glyph a sigil right, in the reaction, which that's the wrong word. Um, but and just everyone meeting up. Just getting to see all these little, just seeing them all grown up, all their like little redesigns. Amity looked amazing. Oh my God, Lilith looked incredible. And just surprising loose at the end there. Oh, what a moment. And then the, bye. Beautiful, beautiful way to end it. Bravo. Thank you for that. Uh, I'm going to, the only thing I hated about this episode was Hootie literally did not have one line. Are you kidding me? How are you not going to give my boy Hootie a line that upsets me? He had some nice little moments there at the end, but as someone who is as big a fan as Hootie as I am, I'm, I'm a little disappointed in that, but that's a nitpick. Let me have it. Let me have it, okay? But overall, great finale, amazing series, absolutely just loved it. I know a lot of you are going to ask me to rank them between Gravity Falls, Owl House, and Amphibia, and I hate doing that because they're all different. They're all so different. They're all so different. And if we're going to just talk about like my pure enjoyment, I would. If we're just going to go by that, by pure enjoyment, because I can't compare them, I can't. But if we're just going to talk about my what I just absolutely just enjoyed the most, I would rank it as Amphibia, Gravity Falls, Owl House. But that's not a slight against Owl House because it, it, it's so hard to compare them. They're all incredible shows. And I think it's an unfair question. But if we're just going to talk about just my pure enjoyment, that's how I would rank it if you had to know. But just absolutely beautiful stuff. Ugh. There was really a moment there where I really thought they may have killed off loose. But I'm like, they're not going to do that. They can't. They just can't. It's not happening. I I would. I just didn't. I just 
for a moment I'm like I, I but the fact that like even though I didn't feel like they were going to do it the fact that I still felt like they would and just felt this whole sinking feeling just tells you so much about the character and how well they you know wrote her and just the voice acting in general oh all the voice act there were some really great moments of voice acting in this episode i can't wait to watch it again honestly but yeah folks thank you thank you thank you so much for joining me on my outhouse journey i've been watching this show and reacting to it since last summer like amphibia and there's just a big piece of me that is very sad it's over these were big 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 shows for my channel not just in terms of just viewership and growing the channel but just getting to just spend time with all of you in the premieres and in the chats and with the comments i'm truly i am gonna miss a lot of that i really am so i hope you all stick around for the other shows i'm gonna be watching i will i i, I recognize so many familiar faces all the time um i've met some really great i've met some other really awesome creators because of this show uh that i you know get to kind of hang out with and talk to almost on a daily basis because of the owl house uh you know we last reacts and uh morgan terry for example we i get to i've met them through this show and they're both both awesome. I'm sure many of you already know who they are, but if you don't, check them out. Check out their channels. Watch their Owl House reactions. You know, I don't know. I mean, like I said, you know, I don't know what life will bring me. I don't know how long I'm going to be on YouTube. But mo the, the, the shows like this, moments like this, time spent working on these videos, I'm always going to remember these, these things. I am. When I'm like 60 whatever years old i'm always gonna remember my time on youtube watching the owl house and all these other shows because they, they they were truly great and you know if i ever have kids someday i'm gonna be showing them these shows 100 percent. we're gonna be watching them again with them and you know if i ever get that opportunity i'm gonna love every fucking second of that 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 sounds that sounds really like a really cool thing <laughs> but uh yeah i i guess that's it that's it that's the owl house uh, folks, thank you for, again, spending time with me, hanging out with me, checking out the video. I appreciate all the likes if you enjoyed the reaction. And let me know in the comments. Let me know what this show means to you. Let me know your thoughts on the finale. Let me know how angry you are that Hootie was underutilized. You don't have to do that, but I'm just... I, I know there's some Hootie fans out there. Where are my Hootie fans at? I, I don't got anything else. I'm exhausted. I've been up since 4.30 in the morning, and it, it's, it is... 9.05 p.m. in the evening when I'm recording this, so I'm tired, <laughs> uh, folks. That's it. That's it for the Owl House. Have a great day. Have a great evening. Hope to see you again. Have a good one. Bye.